I'ma hit you so hard you won't see nothing ever, 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 ever. Audio skulls all day, all day. The merit science is correct. You can't have an opinion on something if you haven't even tried. Exactly. The, the, the merit scientist forever. The, the, the merit scientist forever. The, the, the merit scientist forever. Check, oh. check, yo. Yep, hold on. Of it, not at it. Gotcha, gotcha. I don't know if you wanted to put that on there. I just, I, no, nah, I'm just saying, of it, uh, not at it. No, no uh, context. I got you. Just trying to get this. Yo, shot yo, ladies and gentlemen. What the fuck? Oh, <laughs> what, what, what? I didn't realize you turned the camera on already. Yeah, you said it was recording. Well, I thought he meant audio. Yeah. Carry on, yes. RJ. Yeah, Carry so on. anyway. Yeah. Uh, what's up, guys? Uh, yeah. What's going on? Welcome to episode 31 of yeah. the Mad Scientist Lab podcast. Tree one. Tree one. Tree one. Yeah. 31, 31. 31. Uh, <laughs> it is 30. I, RJ, the pizza guy, along with Jared, the visual mad scientist. Yeah. And as always, Greg. The movie guy. No last names. Yeah, no last names. I'm, I'm finally getting the hang of this. Greg, no last names over here. Is my thumb in there? Is your thumb in there? Can, oh, yeah. Can That's see what it. she said. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. More than likely. Yeah. Just give him the, th- the camera. <laughs> <laughs> that would have been a perfect time <laughs> to do what? Nah. Is the curtain there? He's just giving the camera a thumbs up. That's all that is, guys. Can you hand me some of the coffee creamer that you have? The coffee creamer? The coffee creamer. The shot of coffee creamer. Oh, Yo, I used to have a, uh, I used to have a teacher, a history teacher in high school, mm. and everybody that went to my school probably knows his name. I don't, I forgot it. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a lot of creamer. But he stayed with the, uh, he stayed with like a red cup, solo cup, with a toothbrush in it, in his, in like his classroom. For real? Yeah, and he always smelled like booze. <laughs> <laughs> and we knew like, oh yeah, that's a fucking. Wait, what did he teach? History. Oh man. Well, History's gotten that, up to him. Yeah, that definitely. And what uh, I do, that's did he brush his teeth with this? I think I, either it. I I th- he think it was in the cup, or he would brush his teeth because he was drinking in the classroom. Uh, that's probably what it was. I think. I think as an adult, I'm thinking now. Like, yeah, he would probably just. Yeah, that's and, so great. I knew somebody who did that shit when I worked at Sprint. This guy, he was in the Navy, and like Cheers. we used to talk. He he was a submariner. And like he would tell us all the stories about being in a submarine oh and shit. Oh my god, I don't know why I drink this and, shit. And uh, he like he'd come in and he wouldn't smell like alcohol, but and then it, it'll start smelling like alcohol. Then throughout the day, he, it just start it gets stronger and stronger and stronger. And like you could by the end of the day, you could tell he's like fucked up. Oh yeah. And I was like, how the fuck does one do that? Super super, <laughs> super chatty. Not so or much aggressive. No, nah, he was he was cool. He was so, chill. So he came in calm. But he's a Navy dude. Navy motherfuckers. I think they drink more than Marines for real. He was medicating. Yeah, he was. Would you being in a fucking submarine for years will probably fuck that fuck I, your head up a little bit. I do not like the idea of being underwater for prolonged periods of time, dude. When he would tell me the stories, I'd be like, "Fuck!" Because he 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 said one like a few times they came across a Russians like another Russian submarine. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and like he was oh, yeah, telling you, absolutely. yeah, it like uh, they got to be quiet, and and you're in the fucking deep ocean in a fucking yeah, what the fuck? big metal the, tube, tube. <laughs> stressful, it's a giant metal dildo. It's very it stressful. I mean, so. it sounds cool until you get down there and you're fucking in a real battle because you don't know what's going on down there. Mm. Them motherfuckers are searching for each other all the time in, in, in other water. Speaking of Metallica, so you can destroy it. Um, yeah, my uncle, like, I recently have, I had a bunch of family at the house before the podcast. My uncle was telling us about scuba diving. Like, uh-huh. he would go down and come back up and the boat was gone. What? Yeah. Could but they were, I guess, they, he's, the way he was explaining it is they were circling. Mm-hmm. And then once he popped up, oh, they came to him. Oh, okay. But I was like, dude, what? He oh, was yeah. like, yeah, 15, 15 feet. 15 feet down is dark. Yeah. 
Because like, like fifteen feet, fifteen feet, dog. Like that's all. Could you imagine what's down there too, man? We like I've seen, it. yeah, I've seen so many movies where it's just like, man, if what is some you would, crazy you would shit? Th- is you would really think fifteen there. feet isn't that deep, really? If you have more scuba fifteen gear. feet is deep. Like think about a twelve foot deep pool. How deep that is? I guess, but if you have scuba gear on. But he said, you said, still he said, he said, vast freaking ocean. He said, 15 feet and sinking. I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Uh, uh, yeah, like when I went scuba diving, we were in like, yeah, that was like 15 feet down to the bottom. And where'd you go scuba diving? It was like clear water. Uh, Saint, yeah, it was, it was St. Croix. So, okay. like, it's super clear because I mean, it's kind of shallow and throughout the Caribbean. That's why, like, the water's so clear. But we were still like, like floating above these coral reefs and reefs, reefs or reefs, reefuses, reefuses. Um, but yeah, we're oh, speaking of underwater, yeah. Uh, t- why don't you tell them about the background? Yeah, there. the background. If uh, if any of you guys are familiar, it comes in a trilogy. Um, is a uh, Bioshock is Rapture, uh, from the original game, and it kind of uh takes place throughout. Well, you yeah. sleeping with the fishes tonight, huh? Yeah, Bioshock is an amazing game. It has probably one of the best plot twists in gaming ever. So Actually, that is a cool uh, background. Now, I think you should play that. It's a very, very good game. Man, you uh, tell me to play everything. I don't have time to be playing all these games. You, you should yeah, make I'm, time. I'm really about to miss out on uh, the end of season one of Battlefield. I, you know, I didn't Call, Call of Duty. Duty. Yeah, I yeah. didn't finish any of it. Well, I started it and then I got to sixty, and I but that I haven't played in like three weeks. Uh, so I feel like I could have got to, I would have gotten to a hundred if I had consistently played it. But I just, mm. yeah, yeah, I I, I got yeah. out of it. I'm gonna buy season two. Just I almost thought about selling my Xbox again. No, nah, don't do that. Yeah, because then you'll just end up when another game that you want to play comes out, you just buy another one. Well, it's not it's not really a lot of games that I wanted to play like that. Well, that's why I bought no, the I'm PlayStation saying when they come out though. I mean, I want the I do also want the like 4K Xbox. Mm. Oh, the One X. Yeah, I got the OG Xbox, and my homeboy at work, his um, he said his Xbox died on him. I'm like, well, shit. And I was like, he's like, yeah, I'm gonna get one, get another one. I'm like, which like, like later at home, I was like, man, let's just see if he wants to buy mine. Which ones you think die the most, the the Xbox or the PlayStation? I don't even. I don't even. I know know. the Xbox. What what was 360? Had a shitload of problems, bro. Yeah, Yeah. when it first launched, it had the Red Ring of Death issue. I, I purchased that, and it had the. Uh, the power surge issue, yep, and then overheating, yep. Yeah, well, that's what caused the that was the that, that was the uh, wor- yeah that was the worst uh, console. Yeah, that was. It was a great console, but it was the worst because of that the and technical issues and it had hardware, technical. hardware. Yeah, and Mar- uh, Marvel <laughs> and <laughs> Microsoft didn't do anything about it for like two years. Two three years. Yeah, there were so many different methods. So I, lit- I literally like on oh, my bed. You're good, dude. Go ahead, man. I literally like my first one was out of warranty. And, yeah, and they couldn't do shit you. about it. I'm like, what the fuck? Like, it's not even like two years old. This is like, I didn't do anything to this thing. Why is it fucked up? I'm sorry, we can't do anything for you. So I took it apart and I just started playing around. Like, in the into- I might actually still have that shit, like under uh, under something. But um, then I, I bought three Xbox 360s. Fuck that, man! I've never bought one more than one. I had, any to, buy, I had to buy. Well, two. I had I bought the. I bought the replacement for that one, mm-hmm. and then I didn't buy. I bought two, and then by the time I had that one, and that one started going bad, that's when they were like, "Hey, we'll if you get the red rings, we'll replace your Xbox." There's a real problem here. So I replaced the Xbox twice. Mm-hmm. So I bought a new one and then replaced that twice. All right. Crazy. Yeah. No, I had it happen to mine, and then there was this method where, it was like, if you wrap like a like a heat, towel around heat, it, heat it up. Yeah, yeah, it, it would kind of help start it and everything, and he, help the issue. up with a blow dryer. What? Yeah, yeah dead yeah. serious, dead serious. And it worked for a little while, but then it just crapped out again. So I ended up having to buy a new one too. But stick I to did, Sony, folks. I did uh, upgrade to an Xbox Elite, it, and it had the 500 gigs at the time, mm-hmm. which was like a lot for that console generation. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I had that one until I ended up buying a one. So. It didn't hit me as many times as some other people. Yeah, like, while, while I had that Xbox, like one of the, the latter ones, the last one I had before that started going bad, my dad like randomly just bought me like a PlayStation for Christmas. I was like 20, 21. Mm-hmm. I, no, I, wasn't, I was older than that. I was like 22, 23. I was like, this isn't, you don't need to buy me a video game system anymore. <laughs> I can buy my own. I was like, no, I appreciate it. Like, I, I, I never poo poo gifts. 
I didn't poo poo that gift either. I was like, oh damn, that's tight. You got me. I didn't even ask for one. Like you, you got me a new system. Like you got me a ply station. Yeah, I'm like, thanks, pop. Like, I don't know if my dad or my mom bought it, but my parents presented it to me for Christmas. That was one of the gifts that I had that year. No, well, that's why I bought. Uh, I was like, damn, I didn't ask for this. You definitely could have saved your money or gave me the cash, but then I ended up getting rid of that Xbox and going with the PlayStation uh, Three, Four. Yeah, sounds I, like a this was uh, ass. last PS3 for a while. Finally made a good decision. Nah, this shit was ass. <laughs> what? The I three? still have it. The three was not ass. No, wait, wait which one do you have? Do you have the uh, original one? I had the original one, like the the, the shiny big, joint. Big, no, I don't have the shiny. Yeah, one. I had the original joint. That yeah, I got the, the PS3. Yeah. yeah, I got the yeah. the next gen with the matte Man, flattened out. Yeah, the matte. It's not. It wasn't the slim. Wait, was it a slim or was it? I, I remember. The, I remember when the PS2 came out. With PS2 the was the slim. It was like the size of a little book. I, I love PS2, that. I love that console. Was it PS2 or what the, the PS3? Ones? PS2 was the PS2. slim. PS2. Yeah, it was like a come on with real slim, boxy, like almost joint. And then this one, this was the slim one. Oh uh, yeah, and I had the the big oval like PlayStation that was shiny as hell. <laughs> no, I but <clears throat> so yeah, I, 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 I played that until until uh, I got the three, the one, the Xbox One. Yeah, I, I uh, Xbox, oh, go ahead. I'm sorry. Uh, I bought a four because uh, Sony, I always feel has better single player exclusives. Yeah, uh, and when it comes to like like I guess online like the online community and. And playing Xbox is the way to go because I feel the scene is more competitive. Or that's just the way I've always felt it because, yeah, Halo, Gears. I mean, Call of Duty, it's on both, but it kind of... Yeah, Halo and Gears are like like juggernauts with that. So, Mm -hmm. I mean, it's more multi-platform with everything now. Overwatch, um, you know, even Call of Duty and stuff like that. So... But but I but I was the reason I brought this up is because I finished The Last of Us today, mm-hmm. and that game is dope. It came out in 2014. Uh, but I will say that uh, you know how I was talking about how I've got all these awards, like these mm-hmm. Game of the Year awards. Mm-hmm. Uh, definitely very worthy, very well written, very a very good ending. Uh, I don't want to spoil it. I'm gonna try to play it again. Uh, spoil it for me. I didn't finish it. it. No, no. But it's it's just a very well written story about a guy who loses his kid. At, to um, I guess this I'm outbreak sorry. of an infection, it's kind of like Walking Dead type of th- shit, honestly. Yeah, and um, I, I think when I started playing, it, that's why I didn't finish it because I, I kind of felt that from the beginning. And, and uh, uh, I didn't like the. Well, I gotta finish the storyline, but go ahead. But uh, then he twenty years goes by, and then he befriends a young girl, and he's tasked with this mission to get her safely somewhere because she apparently is infected, but she's not like turning, so she's like the cure. Mm-hmm. And they like build this relationship throughout the game, and you encounter different people and this and that, and it's very, uh, it's got a very uh, an ending where you can debate, which I thought was really really cool. Well, so, well, you you about to finish it? No, I it's, it's no, Jared, you about to finish it? I'm gonna st- I'm gonna play it again because the remastered one is free um, on PlayStation. I downloaded it because mm-hmm. I, I wanted to finish it, but um, yeah, don't tell me. No, 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 no. Of course not. I wouldn't want to spoil. I hate when people. Sp- uh, excuse me, scratch my nose. I gotta finish that damn Star Wars game. God damn. Yeah. Don't have time for all these games. I know, I know. It's okay. So that's uh I guess we that's gaming with the pizza guy right there. Yeah. Yeah. We, we didn't do the intro. Bop. Um we'll figure it out. Yeah. Uh, we got any got anything on the entertainment beaker? On the dark. Nah. I didn't, nah. I didn't I don't remember because we were supposed to have a guest. This week, so, so we didn't plan around that. Yeah, so we're just kind of like, you know, yeah, yeah. Um, it's we gravy, can, baby. I got it all smothered. We can talk about um, the upcoming ev- UFC event this weekend. Uh, I'm poking my eye. Uh, it is UFC for uh, two forty seven yeah. Jones versus Reyes. Um, all yeah. I'm gonna say is Jones is the best fighter out there right now. <clears throat> it's a little soft. Who? John Jones. John Jones is soft? He looks a little soft, like physically. Mm, he could be. He's getting there. He's getting up there a little bit. Uh, is he 32 now? Yeah, that ain't up there. F- f- athletic prime is like 35. Okay. Well, that's little shit. I guess he might be all right then. Yeah, he's good. I mean, I don't, I don't is know. Is that like a, a, a stati- Is that a fact? Yeah. yeah your, your, phys- your, your physical prime is yeah, like. Is around. Your physical prime is what, 25 to 33, 
It, it depends on who you are and how you take care of your body, pump. but you can, yeah, athletic, you can get up to 35. Take care of your body, folks. Yeah. Or if you do a little, hey, what I've been watching a lot of on uh, on the YouTubes. What's that? On the YouTube, I said like OJ Simpson. Uh, on the YouTubes, YouTube, Twitter. Um, this guy, um, I forgot his, his uh, I forgot what his, his name was. Um, I really did. I really, I'm just drawing a blank. But he'll go through like movie stars. Mm-hmm. And or as, well, he hadn't done athletes, but he'll be like, "These are the steroids they might have been using." Wait for movie stars? Yeah, like um, oh, he, to get big and shit yeah, for the movie. He, he, uh, he did Jason Momoa. He did. Um, yeah, he's Samoan though. He he could be natural. Well, like. he that's he 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 will break it. Like he'll break down. I think this. I think this is natural. That's mm-hmm. a natural progression of way. Another one he did was Tom Hardy. Tom Hardy was on some shit. Yeah, he said. He said. He said. Um, <laughs> when he was Bane, nigga, God. <laughs> well, not even Bane. When he was in Warrior, that's when he said this was his physical peak, and he was like thirty five. Warrior was the you have, like the the MMA movie with him and uh, Ed- Edgerton, Joel Edgerton, where they were brothers. I, oh yeah, yeah. I you never see, seen that? I think I did. I think I did. You don't remember that movie? That's uh, it was hard. That's a, yeah. That's a, one of my friends. Um, well, hard. we all know him. I just don't want to say his name. Uh, that's one of his favorite movies. Um, it was hard as hell. I liked it. Yeah, but, it's Tom Hardy though too. We, we were just talking before we went yeah. on on the air. We were, we were talking about Tom Hardy and how beast of an actor, kind of slept on actor, right? Um, but because I've been watching a lot of his stuff, I have noticed some of his voices are the same. Well, I mean, I guess it has to be the same. Well, yeah, he don't he don't got too many. He ain't got. A, he know doesn't have a lot of range. Yeah. But his his vocally vocally yes exactly but everything else like it pulled like there was one joint and Peaky Blinders he's just a very intense person yeah it, 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 it like the monologue he was doing that's what he's good at monologues yeah. like when he did the Bane joint like so um yeah no Jared needs to get a new laptop and I told him yeah well, the, our guest last week said they were gonna do it so we'll see. Uh, well, yeah, I just, but I was also telling him, like, man, if you just really need one right now and you don't want to put it on credit or anything like that, just take a fucking quick 401k. Yeah, take a little quick little I mean, two grand out your, your 401k, pay that shit back in six months. I could put it on the Apple card. And it, no, you don't do that. Man. Yeah, no, I don't do that shit. Back take, it, take it out of your 401k and they'll just take it out of your check. Mm. Low, yeah. That's I, I just do. told you. Well, oh, you don't have Oh, you don't have Yeah, yeah. Uh, folks, folks. Put money into your four hundred one k's, like. Greg yeah. is very adamant about this, by the way. I mean, it's just it's it should be. yeah, just put put money in your four hundred one k's, like for real. Uh, you know what? I can do that little space. I can use that to, 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 for an ad. You should you should do it. Well, Greg for who? The fucking for bottle. Stitcher. Oh, I don't have the. Oh, you know what? I can pull the. Well, well, well we're here in the show now. No, I know. But so what we talking about? So you, we're talking about uh, steroids, Tom Hardy. Yeah. And, and how he it looked so okay so the guy so what did he say Tom Hardy used to make himself like super buff and all that well other he, shit? he he doesn't he he doesn't really give you like a breakdown of like what it is so he's just like yeah he did this but yeah it it was like you know this footage of him at like twenty one twenty two and he's like super skinny yeah he's a skinny dude and he's like if you look at his frame he's not a big guy he doesn't have big arms and then it went to like when he was like thirty and it was like he put on he's still a skinny he's like skinny fat. You but know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, he's he doesn't look so old. And then when he did Warrior, it was like, I think it was Warrior or some other, no, Bronson. When he did Bronson, he was like, he had to put on, what, 20, 25 pounds in five months or some shit? Wasn't he kind of big and lawless, too? That was after Bronson. Oh, okay. That was, at, that was like, that was like Warrior time. I don't know if I've seen... Bronson. Yeah, it's not. It's 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 not worth it. I've watched it, but it was like ah. So I was gonna say, since we were talking about his acting and how we think he's underrated, is there any reason in particular you don't think he is kind of praised? Uh, I mean, I think he is. Yeah, I think he's he is, he's starting to get he, there. But he's just an intense dude. Like he can't really. Yeah, it's, he. Well, I mean, uh, he's no, like he's like Joaquin Phoenix. Like mm, no, no, no. Not, well, I'm not talking about their their acting skills comparing. I'm talking about their personalities off screen. Like they're they're like really like you can't really get they they won't let you in past their their wall you know what I'm saying? Well, I heard they both can rap, so there's that. Hey, beast! What? Like I heard they both can rap. Yeah. Oh, dude, I remember Joaquin for sure. Yeah, did that like 
Yeah, I was like, yo, what's going on with this guy? He had like a weird phase in his life. Who, Joaquin Phoenix? Yeah. You know, if it's a phase, I just think he, he, no, he was doing that movie. Oh, what? Joker? No. 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 The, when he remember he went on uh, Letterman, he was acting all fucking weird. This was years ago, right? Yeah, uh, yeah no. But okay. he, he was doing like performance art. Mm. Man, I don't think he's weird. I just think motherfuckers be playing with the goddamn system. Performance art or method acting? Method. No, nah, like that That was a performance art. Oh. Mm. Well, sometimes these people are weird too. I mean, I don't know. It's weird. You got the whole world knowing who you are and in your business and shit. It's probably, it probably feels weird as fuck, dude. Yeah. He, did y'all know he found his brother? Like, he's, yeah. the, he's the one who called the fucking ambulance on yeah. River Phoenix? Yeah. That's crazy. That has mm. to suck. Wait, his brother? I, I, I'm not sure. River Phoenix? You, you never, never heard, heard that? You never, you never heard of River Phoenix? No, you're if 30. You're 30. He, he, he would not have heard of River Phoenix. Yeah. Uh, what was the movie? Uh, Kid? No. No, he was in a couple of movies. That, that one that all them kids were in. The Outsiders? Yes. No, he wasn't in that. He was River Phoenix that. wasn't in that? Mm-hmm. Are you sure? River Phoenix was still kind of young. Let's see, let's look it up, folks. Yeah, look that one up. I'm yeah, so wait, that's sure his brother? He was in there. Yeah. We need some music for this. Music? Some searching music. Searching music? You should use Jared's well, curtain thing. It will be a thing. No, because then he ha- how are you going to pull that up? Stand By Me. He was in Stand, Stand By, by me. me. That's the movie that Let I'm me thinking see. of. He was 23. When yeah. did he die? 1993. Born in 1970. Are you sure he wasn't an outsider, though? Nope. Oh, dude, that was only like five my years old. Private, That's I, my own private Idaho. Indiana Jones. He was young Indiana Jones. Dr. Indy. Dr. Jones. I mean, yeah, Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. Yes, he was not in... He was in Stand By Me. That's the that's the key. That's the one I'm thinking about. Okay, my busy. It's so quiet this week. Like last week was loud as shit. We had uh, we had two other people down. Extras. Here. Yeah, we did have two other people down. And, here. and <laughs> your good friend Tony was drinking up the most liquor I've ever seen. Yeah, it's he was, not the most you've ever was, seen. Nah, it was a lot. I've seen you drink about the same before. He, he was going straight. <laughs> he was going straight into the fucking beaker with the. With the, with the 151. With the big bottle. I'm like, Jesus. I'm, I'm Wait, glad I put, was, I put ice in there Was that 151? I don't, I, don't, I don't think it was 151. Oh, okay. like, God damn. It was something. It was something crazy. It's that gangster shit. Like, like, who's that bottle for? He's like, me. Oh, okay. Man, he got the big bottle. I'm like, jeez. Sorry. Sorry. Relax, brother. Oh, man. I've been drinking that 1738. 1738. I wasn't, I wasn't going in, like, before, like, a couple of them people remember my, <laughs> they remember my, me for my dad's funeral. It was like, yeah, dude, you, uh, oh, you're not drinking that brown today, are you? I'm like, nah. You're not drinking that brown. It, oh, keep, dude, I was. Phew. Keep hearing that. Is that like really a thing? If you drink a whole bottle of Knob Creek, yeah. Oh, shit. That, I mean, that's good, though. That's a good. Um, Knob Creek. Not, there's not another, drinking a whole bottle. There's no, an, not, not drinking. There's one up, called Mount I ended Gay. Up with, I ended up lucky. At what? What is it called? It's called Mountain Gay. Dude, I'm dead ass fucking serious. Go into the ABC store and look under the, uh, the bourbon. Ask, you ask RJ, for that? RJ was like, I can't quit you. <laughs> 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 I walked by and I had to look at it again. I was like, is Mountain that, Gay? Is that what is that where they were sipping on Brokeback Mountain? I guess, dude. <laughs> Mountain Gay. That's what made them. Well, yeah. <laughs> Awkward silence. So, social justice warrior, please don't come after us. Oh, speaking of social justice warriors. Yes. Oh, shit. We about to get canceled. No, man. <laughs> so, okay. So you guys watched the halftime show for the Super Bowl, right? Not really. Okay. I did. So, okay. I mean, I, it was on. I just wasn't paying attention. Okay. So normally I don't bitch or complain about any of this stuff, but there are so many people that are upset apparently about the, the show. I don't know. And it's like really, it's not I'm bothering t- me, but know, it's really interesting. You know something, bro? People I'm, suck. Dude. I'm tired of giving a fuck what it pisses other people off. Yep. Like it doesn't matter. I don't. Yeah. I don't it doesn't. But it's just so, so fucking dumb. When I when, when so I see dumb. when I see motherfuckers doing that fucking grandstanding on their Facebook pages and shit, yeah. I just keep scrolling. Like you're wasting your time. <laughs> like, you're not gonna waste mine. <laughs> You're like, oh, oh, they're it's for kids and the little boot. Shut the fuck up. Get a life. Yeah, get wow, a- relax, man. Yeah, it's just- crazy. <laughs> no, it's real shit though. 
You got all that time to talk shit on Facebook. Why? Guess what? They're making money while you talking shit on Facebook. I saw a lot of dummies. La- saw a lot of Latinas on my timeline. Oh yeah, good that's word. how we do it. I'm like that's that's what we we know that's how you do it. Yes, that's why we, we like you. We're, we're, <laughs> we're aware. I would let them smother me, but that's besides the point. Would you? Would you? Uh, <laughs> what I want? Would you? Uh, it, so Jennifer Lopez performs halftime. Would you eat that fresh off the stage? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> I definitely did, eat that. Did fresh you see off no the hesitation. Stage. There, there, there's a picture <laughs> of one of the dead. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna have to wash. The, the Craig, stop doing that. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna tell you why. I'm gonna tell you why. Smell like. Because I've been, I, I've been sweat I, I had a long, crush on Jennifer Lopez before people was even crushing on Jennifer them, Lopez. Them, them long fifty-two year old pussy lips, hey. get the dangling on your nose. It is what it is. The meat. <laughs> she's fifty-two. She she's fifty. Oh, she's fine as fuck. Yep. No, she's over fifty, man. Right. No, she's fifty. Don't look matter. it up. Look it oh, up. Oh yeah, she is fifty because everybody was posting that. Yeah, that's yeah. how I know. <laughs> fifty and forty-three. I'm like, look, like, man, what do you like? What do you expect a fifty-year-old who's like in really good shape to look like? Yeah, she's been dancing her whole fucking life. Yeah. What do you expect? Her like that's ain't... aerobics and that she doesn't fucking uh, exercise. She doesn't uh, consume caffeine or alcohol. Hmm. Maybe not anymore. I'm sure she did at some point. Yeah, at some point. Well, yeah, at some point. Okay, but it's no apparently no longer in her diet. I did some oh, yeah. research. Well. I was bored at work. You did some research, huh? Yeah, I did. Mm-hmm. Hey, man, the day after the Super Bowl, nothing A-Rod, happens. A Rod gonna come get you. That's man. <laughs> A Rod, slap him in his fucking bare face, dude. He ain't got no facial hair, and he can't run a baseball team. Oh, run a baseball team? Who's he? More Florida, Miami. Nah, he don't I mean, shit, it, well, excuse me, Florida. You're right, Florida Marlins. It used to be. Miami. Is he still there, or does he? I don't know if he's still there or they they, they booted him, but um, he was there last season. He's literally he's basically just handed the fucking Yankees Giancarlo uh, stand 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 like here. Well, that's all he had. They he was probably trying but to get he something. Didn't, he didn't get nothing back with that. He just he just sent him to the to the. Yankees. Well, that's part of the problem. He don't know what the fuck he's doing. Yeah. Well, you can play baseball, bro, but he's you very, can't he's run a very, team. He's very, he's very good in the booth, huh? Nothing. You got to flip them pies. Yeah. So shout out to my staff who did a great job on oh, Sunday. Yeah. Super Bowl Sunday, yeah, busiest yeah. day of the year for him. Uh, yeah, it was fine, man. It, it went well. Uh, we actually had this lady screaming in my lobby uh, because, I don't know, it's a long story. I on the Super Bowl Sunday? Yeah. Like we had you to tell take, her to eat a dick. <laughs> uh, no, my other manager did. Hold on. Eat a dick up to your hiccup. My other manager, I'm he's busy. so... He's so uh, this is why I like working with him. He's just so... When it comes to people, he can be like mad cold. He's just like, nah, I ain't doing this shit. Yeah, fuck you. The, the, and the way he does, dude, the way he does it is hilarious. Hey, haven't you? So I'm standing there watching, like I'm standing behind him. She's <laughs> like, not, she's not acknowledging like me. Like you aren't in charge. <laughs> yeah, exactly. She's like, probably who the fuck is this guy, right? Because I had my red shirt and everything on. And I was just standing there with everybody else, and we were just watching her yell about something that was out of our control. And the, the they, cheese she, is it, too cheesy. <laughs> and then her and then her boyfriend tried to come up around the counter. Oh no! Uh, yeah, yeah, nah. yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. Cops straight away. Bro. And then my my one driver, uh, he's he's a real big sturdy guy. I like him a lot. And he was just like, hey man, you're not coming back here. And he was like, oh, oh I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And my other driver it's was so like, hey, let's go outside, like bitch, take it, it easy. It feels so good when you do that to somebody. Yeah, dude. Like, he was well, just like, like, no, you ain't going. You nowhere. can do that. I do do that. I man. can't do that. Oh, that shit feels great. I that, just have to stare him down. That back down is just like. Like, oh yeah, yeah. It may it takes a little longer for me, but when they fucking see in my eyes, then they're like, oh nah, no, let me. <laughs> no, nah, I've I've stared so many people down. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> it looks weird on camera. Exactly. Because <laughs> why would you fuck with somebody that looks like that? <laughs> yeah, exactly. All right, Greg, you're scaring us. I don't do the teeth thing, bro. I got this shit from my dad. My dad used to do that shit. Oh, when he got fucking, when he get mad, frustrated, he used to get frustrated with me all the time. <laughs> <Oof>. <laughs> Why are you out of? Damn it, Gregory! <laughs> Gregory, <laughs> like, oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> when the full name comes out, chill, 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 chill. I was on that Dude, I, I had my dad scream me out of a dream one time. <laughs> I was in, I was, I was in the dream. I, and I dreamt I was I, I remember this shit because it was just so funny and I had to be like in high school because he was just waking me up for the morning and I, I was dreaming when I was still in uh, elementary school yes, like sir. I was in that classroom 
and he was outside, and I could look out the window, and he was just screaming my name. Greg, Greg! Outside? Yeah, in, in the dream. <laughs> Greg, oh, in the dream. Greg! <laughs> Greg, Greg! And next thing you know, I like wake up, I'm like, oh, that's real. He's in his <laughs> bedroom. Greg, Greg! Just waking me up, I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> Time to wake up. That was not the dream. He, he literally... Inceptioned himself in my dream, oh, man, that's screaming a, my name. Such a great movie. I watched it today. Uh, dude, you know what my mom used to do in high school to wake me up? It'd be like wake fucking, me up. It'd be like nine thirty in the morning, man. Just sleeping in a little bit. She would literally just bust in my uh, uh, into my room Mm-mm. and uh, with the it. with the vacuum going, just <laughs> running it next to my bed. She's like, "Are you awake yet?" I'm like, I'm dead serious. Yes, that's what she, that's exactly what she would do every weekend to just literally just come kick it in the door with the vacuum just roaring, running it next to me. Are you awake? Are you awake? And like, yes, I am now. Fucking Jesus. Yeah, yeah. Well, my mom used to be like, even on the weekends, like, it tw- it's 12 o'clock. You can't be sleeping the whole damn day. Yeah, way it, day it, away. Nah. Yes. Yeah, so, yeah, for what? <laughs> it's a weekend. There's nothing happening. Yeah. After a while. We're going to watch TV and do things we probably shouldn't be. After, after a while, my parents are just like, man, just, just let him sleep. He's fine. Yeah, he doesn't do anything. Yeah, like, he's, he's a good kid. To get to he that. doesn't do anything else. Just leave him alone. But also, uh, <laughs> my dachshund, my dog used to sleep in the bed with me. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> that's partially why my dad would just be screaming my name because. They would come when they would come in the room to try to wake me up, mm. especially my dad. My, my man Barney would be like, like he was, oh, he was going, yeah. He was like, no, nah, you're not putting your hands on the bed. He wouldn't do anything. Should, should I do this? My dad was for mad. Shit. Go ahead, man, hit man, that shit. All right, making hit that uh, shit. Asking for permission for shit. Hit that shit, uh, because, who knows? Uh, Jesus, it's like the Australia wildfire. But yeah, he uh, yeah, he he inceptioned himself it's a joke. too soon, bro. Too, yeah, too soon. soon. Right. Too soon. It's still going yeah, on. Yeah, exactly. Oh, what I'm saying. <laughs> the views of RJ are not the views of the Mad it's Scientist Lab fire. podcast. Up in here, it's burning hot. It's on fire. Oh, can we? Mm, do we want to go there? Go where? I don't know where you want. Don't want to yeah. go. The Ari Shafir thing. Hey, fuck him. That's it. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, you know that look, it was It Shafir. wasn't funny. It was the wrong time to do it. It was bro. definitely the wrong time. That was that was a too soon joke. Yeah, it was like okay. What you, oh yeah. So what did he say, man? I didn't read it. Fuck, I'm not even giving it any energy. He, uh, just just trying to just negativity. He was bringing up Kobe's past right after Kobe. Oh, that part. Oh yeah. I unfriended people. Who was defending the shit? Not yeah. defending that. Nah, <clears> I've, I've, oh, it was a couple of chicks and like. Dude, he's it's like an hour afterwards, mm. and he like he's a rapist. I'm like, one, he was not convicted, right? Okay, mm-hmm. so that 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 was a wrong like sentence just to say he wasn't convicted. But I personally don't think it was a you know. The situation well, we don't was. have to go into that, but we don't know. We don't know. I don't know. I can get killed. All those cir- I can get killed for that. But I, I whatever, man. It's we're past it. You know, people change. Yeah. No matter if he did it or not, if he did it, that's fucked up. But you know, I don't know. I can't. I can't speak on that. I don't know. But shit, man, the motherfucker just died, bro. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. With his daughter, at forty-two years old, forty-three years old, and she's thirteen. Like, don't don't, don't be, have some class. Yeah, you know, there were memes like immediately. And then I like removed like two people. Yeah, I removed. I'm rude. One chick. I'm like, come on, man. I don't even like know you like that. Well, get yeah. the fuck out of here. People can get the fuck out of here. They can get removed easily. Yeah. That's no, that's no you problem. You can get blocked out of my life. That's what, yeah. uh, that's what we're saying is because yeah, get out of here. Like if you that. offend us, I motherfucker, I follow motherfuckers we'll all the you. time. That's why I never reach the, the like. I, I stay around the the one thousand friends mark because well, oh. people come, people go. <laughs> Dude, I have like four hundred. I really don't want people to look at like who I follow on Instagram. <laughs> oh, you're talking about Instagram? What are you talking? I was about? talking about Facebook. Oh, Facebook! I don't know what I don't know who I follow on Facebook. No. Yeah, I don't have no. I feel like after the after the day, I feel like I gotta add all my family members on there now. Cause I didn't add. That's because uh, I didn't add my uncle, and I was like, "That's for me. That's a little. That's you're you're messing the thing up. Oh, is it making noise? Yeah, it's going in and out on this one ear. Oh shit! Um, that was the headphones. Hippity hop. Yeah. Oh, it's messing your headphones. Up. Yeah. Oh, okay, I got you. Um. 
Shit, I lost my train of thought. Yeah. Don't do that. Yeah, adding family members. Oh, adding family members. Um, yeah, that's a little weird for me. Because then, like, I don't want to feel like... I, I even do this for anybody, to be honest, that I know. I'm like, I don't... F- Feel that I have to like every one of your pictures oh, that, that comes up. Like, no, no, that's not. How but it's sometimes it's like uh, this is like a cool moment for them. They might like really want some like. So like, should I give it to them? When to like and when not to like. Yeah, is what he's saying. That is the question. I just don't want you to bring up nothing to me later, like at a function. Yeah, like no, you, didn't. you didn't like my picture or my video. No, like, I haven't. Uh, I don't man. have family like that. Thank God. No, I'm not saying. I'm not saying I have family like that. It's just. There have been encounters with people in general where, how come you didn't like my picture? Blah, blah, blah. Um, maybe I didn't see it. Maybe I scrolled past it because I was busy. I don't know. Like, whatever. Maybe I don't like you. Oh, I don't know. I wouldn't say so, all that. <laughs> could you imagine? Because we want people to like, <laughs> share, and subscribe this show. There's a subscribe button down there in the corner. Just hit that button. Yeah, Thanks. the corner. And the, click the bell. Oh, my God. The cracking of Yes. Cluck, cluck. Cluck, cluck, cluck. So that was my, I don't know, that's how I felt about, you know, the whole Super Bowl what thing. What the fuck? And, yeah, yeah, and congrats. What? what? No, nothing. I'm just on something. I was like, man. I thought you died in a video you know, game. Sometimes when you fucking retweet something and you look at who, like, posted it, I'm like, ooh, why? When why? You retweet something? You retweet, retweet something somebody posted on Twitter. I always check before I, who did it before I, I do it. Yeah, man, I should. It was a good fucking... Tweet. <laughs> so as Greg uh, gives into his admission of guilt, somebody, somebody that I hated, I somebody fucking hate I that hate. motherfucker. I don't, I, don't I don't like you or you. No hate, no hate, no hate. Are you? No hate. Are you? What? Man, we gotta come up with something for you to do this week. Like, Who? Me. This guy. You're here, man. People love you, bro. Yeah. My family loves you, man. Hey, no, I love your family too. I love you, man, bro. They hate me, huh? No, they don't hate yeah, you. Yeah. Everybody hates me. Nah. They just, they just, <laughs> my fuckers keep telling me, you gotta calm down. I'm like, <laughs> no. It's my, so true. my uncle just laughs that RJ be like hammered. Yeah. <laughs> like, he just be sitting in the middle. <laughs> like, fuck them with you. Hey, it's all right, man. It's, no, pizza, I have fun. The pizza guy, they call you the pizza guy. Oh, that's cool, man. Like, the pizza guy, <laughs> well, I no, mean, Jared. That's what he is. No, oh, I thought you said, what do you I, call me? I, I am a no, 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 sir. I'm talking about him. Oh. I am more than a pizza man. A pizza man is like, man. I am, I am the giver of the, to the community. Yeah. yeah. If, if we can figure out how to get, like, patched in, my Uncle Tab, Uncle Tab will be cool. Like, he got some To call in? Yeah. We just need, like, a well, phone. He don't want to be on camera? He just want to be He on. lives in, like, he, he doesn't live close. Nah, oh, man, okay, we okay. should just call him and put him on speaker. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah. Or if you Dude, do, we should call somebody. Next to the mic. Yeah, we should just call somebody randomly right if, now. No, no. Uh, the whole that, <laughs> no, because then <laughs> you got to tell them, hey, this is this is Jared Smith from the Bad Side Just Lab Podcast Show. Is it all right if we get you on the air? Wait, you what? Have all that. Wait, what, what? You have to how? you have to let them know that they're being recorded. Dude, we should prank call my store. Oh, we can. I mean, no, we'll, we're not calling nobody right now. Oh, okay. But yeah, we're we'll, we'll, gonna fuck we'll, them up. We'll, guests, we're trying to figure out how to get guests on here and get them. You know. To show up. Active, yeah. My, my cup, my uncle Ted. <laughs> yeah, my uncle Ted. <laughs> to show up. No, I was looking right at the camera, so everybody. <laughs> yeah, to I, show up. I ain't worried about that. My uncle, yeah, but my uncle Ted got hella stories. He was telling the stories, like, before he left the house today about, uh, he used to work, you know, used to be a prison, uh, I, I don't know if I want to say guard. I don't think it was, he was more than that. Correctional officer. Correctional officer. There you go. Correction. I couldn't, I can't think right now. But yeah, he just got hella stories. Hella stories. He was talking about, how, yeah, he was talking about how he uh, he's had guys on like work release from the halfway house and shit. Just one motherfucker would like one person deviates, you all are going back and you're losing money, mm. and I'm violating you and you're going back to. It's a team. It's yeah. a team sport. Yeah. <laughs> so he was yeah a collective effort by uh, those that are convicted. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, I'll ask him. I'll be like, yo, you trying to just a quick little twenty minute call or something. Oh, by the way, our guest that was supposed to be here this week, please do not have the coronavirus. <laughs> he doesn't. Oh, you no, talking about? Oh. I'm talking about the other one. It's the a original. Secret. The original. It's a one. secret. Yeah, it's a surprise. It's a surprise. Uh, what was I going to say? Oh fuck! I lost my train of thought. No, it's a perfect surprise. No, I forgot what I was going to say. Stick to the motherfucking bullet points. Stick to the well, fucking. We, we, we huh. didn't. We didn't have many. Huh. Nobody. Did anybody huh. add to subtract? Nah, no, man. man we I was didn't busy know. today. 
well, Greg has a legitimate reason. To yes, not. Greg has a legitimate mm. reason. Hey, man, I only <laughs> Royal Rumble. Royal Rumble. Yes. Yeah, what? You never did your. your I did your... last week. No, you didn't. I did. Men being emotional. That's on there. What's that? Oh, about? <laughs> oh. Um... Yeah, men being emotional. I love. Well, oh. that kind of came up with. That kind of came up with the whole. Oh, gets emotional for sure. Kobe Bryant. Sometimes. Uh, oh, we're, we're, uh, we're not going to talk. No, because okay. <laughs> <All right. laughs> you cut me off last week, and I was pissed off. About well, that. We're not what, what, talk about well, that. what I wanted, but we talked about it. Nah, you cut me off, man. I, 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 I know. My heart started. I cut my heart open. It was starting to bleed on my shirt, and you put a tourniquet on it, and I was like, "Fuck!" I was about to give my ode to Kobe. I was going to get my old. Do you want to do it now? I, I can't do it now. It's not the moment has passed. Like I'm, I'm not. Okay. I'm, I'm like not invested in it. Well, what I was getting at with this particular subject is how what was it men, men being emotional? Yes, I mean, is, I got, I got is how there. people are Process. are able to now that this whole thing has happened. Um, they other cultures can see how. Black men? Black men well, show their emotion when it comes to something like this. Did I post that article? Did you read the article? That's a I lot deeper. Probably. I'm not I posted sure. a couple articles. I posted one article about... Uh, Talk about the white women? That one. And yeah, I, I've read that yeah, one. Yeah. Then I, I posted... I, I don't know if I posted the other one. The other one was um, a woman from, I from think a woman's I may, point I, of view. I think I may Talking have. about she now she understands how, <clears throat> you know, black men grieve. Mm-hmm. Like... She, she, you know, she thinks that we're, you know, some monolithic, super machismo strong. Well, that's what that's what society is supposed to. That's what society has given us because we've had to be so strong because we're dealing with. Yeah, all they also the, don't think the that we're like stuff. human sometimes. Okay, this is exactly what I wanted yeah, to yeah, kind of get go. into. Yeah, let's get into the good shit. Yeah, and she was like, uh, she was like, she was out with one of her male friends. Like how we were out fucking eating lunch mm-hmm. when we found out. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, and she was like, he was just like vapid. Yeah. Like drained, like shocked, didn't know what to do. And then she looked around and like they were in a pretty mixed crowd, you know what I'm saying? But she saw every black dude like was just like. Stuck. Like, stuck. That's how we were. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was definitely like, yeah. you got to process it. Yeah. As was I. Yeah, well, well, yeah, yeah. We're not, we're not trying to exclude. Yeah, we're not excluding men. anybody. We're this speaking. is men's. That's why I said men's being men being emotional. No, but the, the, I think there's a tendency to, to to for in general, not just black men, but in general for society to think that men only can have two feelings: yeah, angry and happy. Yeah, we're, we're you know we're, what I'm saying. We don't have nuance. Yeah, and I think that starting to kind of change especially with the whole mental health thing we're fucking people too you know yeah we need to talk into the mic oh sorry <laughs> i knew that so I'm, so, I, so, every so, week so, when so. i have to edit this shit i'm like god damn it rj talking to the mic sorry i just feel like I just, see I, you're, you're away from it again yeah i know but i just feel like if, <laughs> we just gotta put a lavalier on him yeah, yeah i think nah. we're gonna or he can scoot closer no nah, just put the mic there for for uh <laughs> put the mic there for decoration don't even connect it <laughs> oh yeah we might have to do that have the clips because the front is right here on your friend job. is right here. Okay. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, yeah. So, so my bad. So what were you saying? Yeah, but I mean, it, it, yeah, man. Because I had emotional day today, so it's like you, you got to delve into them parts. You can't condense or compress that shit because that shit will come out in like not healthy ways. Yeah, and I think I don't know if I I I I, I do recognize it more um, now. Mm-hmm. Uh, than I did uh, maybe a, a couple years ago. That, that like I need to kind of work, let the feeling like actually feel the feeling. Uh, that's something I'm. It's I'm, making me feel feelings. No, Ooh. no, like you have <laughs> you have to actually. All right, this is what I'm feeling. You got to process it. it. Yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. But you have to know, you have to name the feeling because you it, you kind of, it to, for it not to build up, if you name it, like, all right, this is jealousy, you kind of take the power away from it. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and then once you process, all right, this is jealousy. Why am I feeling this way? All right, boom, boom, boom. Is it, can I really help it? 
no. So then fucking fuck it. So tell me, Jared, do Keep you feel going. jealous sometimes? I say no. Nah. Like a therapist. <laughs> uh, that's, how, that's how therapists are like, so you mm. you will sit there talking to so my, my let's pick that apart. I thought now about that, being okay. a therapist. My name is Dr. City Set You thought about being a therapist? Yeah, yeah. Like I'm dead serious. That's like psychology <laughs> for like a Can't semester. Cross my legs, or, man. A quarter and I learned some stuff. Okay. Um Okay. Well, that, just because we're on it, I thought about doing that. No, no, I, 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 well, we're going to, since we're in here, um, you're right. We're, the, we're in the emotional beaker. Sometimes, <laughs> sometimes <laughs> therapists do that, um, but a lot of times, in my recent experience, a lot of times, they'll just sit back and just wait and then. Let you talk it out. Yeah. That's all it is. This is like you talking through your feelings. Um, it's making me feel feelings. <laughs> I don't know about all that. Like, <laughs> but see, but see what you but what you're doing right there is you're making it seem like seem like a sissy fucking move. I'm not making this make sense. Uh, well, you're you're making light of it when well, it's yeah. not. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not not. This is a, I'm not trying to knock you. It's a partial comedy show. So. I get it. I get it. Um, but. At the same time, if we're trying to if we're trying to change people's minds, we gotta let them like. Well, like, they gotta change their minds. They, their minds going. That's their job to change their minds. We just explain where we're coming from. Yes, it ain't no game. It's, bitches just understand my story. You feel me? Yeah. No. Nah, nah, yeah. I was yeah. like, who's that? look at these motherfuckers? Yeah. Yeah. We're on the same page. It ain't no game. It's just some chicks that understand my story. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like that's a real ass it's bar. Like yeah. it's not game, dog. It's just you feel me. Nas is an emotional dude. You, not, can, you can tell in his music. I don't know if he's as deep as he. Uh, I'm not saying he's not deep, but I'm saying he's emotional. You can see, it, like, what was it? Was a godson? I you, thought that was the most horrible shit ever. Yeah, with the album. Yes. <laughs> nah, it's got I, see, a couple of good, nice cuts on there. Them, yeah. them not, not that one with the kids singing. I was but, about to say I screaming, can. but yeah. <laughs> I think I can. Hey man. Like shut the fuck up, all hey. y'all. <laughs> That's that that well you just you just you're, you're. Jared is hating on the youth and but, no, but I'm it's not, not hating a, on the youth. The youth oh. them babies, baby them. Well, it's like then you have to think about it like this. Them like, kids is like, like thirty now. No they're they're bullshit. Twenty something. R- RJ's thirty. Twenty something. So you telling me RJ was in the I I can <laughs> video? In two thousand and if I want to be if he was fifteen, <laughs> the, the kids was kids kids. Those were like when, when did that album come out? Like two thousand two? I don't care. Dude, yeah, anything right. past I am, I'm like on. Oh, yes, know. exactly. You didn't fuck with Still Mad. Wait, did I am come out? Still Mad is it okay. has some cuts. Yeah, yeah. Any like, like everything that came out, I think he's right. After, after I am, that's it. It, it was written. Nostradamus no. was ass. No, yeah, that's, yeah, uh, that, I like Nostradamus. Nah. Nasty, Nostradamus. I made, I, well, you know what I liked on that one? I like the... Um, Nostradamus. I like the... No, ne- no he is Negro. Is Thomas. that the one with, where he did... I, I don't know. Are you talking about with... Uh, Jimmy, Diddy and Diddy Scarface? And, 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 Hate and now Jimmy, Pl- <laughs> Jimmy Plant. Not Jimmy Plant. Uh, Jimmy Page. No. Ooh, that sounds... That's, that's from that's Led Zeppelin. The guitarist from Led Zeppelin. Yeah, that wasn't Nas. That was Nas. That was, that was the, Diddy and Nas. That was from the Godzilla Kant soundtrack. Yeah, and it was Diddy and Nas. Ugh. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, nah. Anything past anything past I am, I'm just like. I think I. Oh wait, I am. What, what, what was on I am? Nas uh, is like New York State. Yeah, Nas is like. Oh, Nas. <sighs> yes. Oh, that was uh, the one where yeah, Ether, New York State of Ether Mind was on there. No, that's on no, Stillmatic. That's, that's, that's Illmatic. Illmatic. New York State of Mind. Wait, Steak. Uh, New York State of Mind. It's part Illmatic. two. Illmatic. Illmatic is no. the Illmatic first is the one. first one. Yes. Illmatic yes. is the is, New- one of, is probably the greatest hip hop album of ever. I agree. Pre- with produced the? probably the greatest hip hop album ever, bro. <sighs> I don't ever. Greg's, Greg's right, man. Ever. He was 16 when he was writing some of them rhymes? Mm. Uh, 19 when it came out. So, I mean, but who knows how long it took him yeah, to it actually write it. three years. Yeah, Ten it's, tracks. It's, it's back in the day. Like, you couldn't, it wasn't, I wasn't recording in my booth and uploading to the internet in a month. Yeah, that album is, I, I could listen to it from front to back all the time. What, what no, year no, did he do? That's Star- when you had to actually go to studios and shit. Yeah, what year did he do Star Wars? Somebody had to put you on. Star Wars? Yeah, it was. Oh, like, I remember that That was the that first too. song he was ever on. It was on that. It, that was on the lost tapes, wasn't it? No, I swear that's on the lost tapes. It was somebody else's song, wasn't his? Oh, it was a, <clears throat> he was a preacher. Hold up, he was a preacher. Feature. Feature. Oh, my shit was. I'm uh, a son of a 
preaching, man. What was the second one? That was my shit. What? It, it was, was written. It was written. Yeah, yeah, that was my shit. Yeah, that was the one. I, but that was the first. That's what introduced me to Nas. Me too. But, yeah, like a but, lot of people at that time, I came into their second joint. Like uh, Jay Z, I came into his second joint. No, nah, I came in at. I came in at. I was on Hard Knock Life. Really? That late? I mean, yeah. not to say that late, but ninety. That's ninety. Star Wars was on Yo Matic. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's his song. Or I thought it was on the Lost Tape. So, but it originally came out like on a mixtape. Yeah, and it was like an added track. It wasn't like right. a part of the okay. Yeah, mixtapes was like. Star Wars the shit back Star then. Nah, the one that he had on the Lost Tapes, what is it? Nothing Lasts Forever? That's a really good one. Mm, I didn't like the Lost Tapes. Yeah. Rampity, scappity, scappity, scappity. <laughs> yeah. Like, uh, Nas, I, so wait. I saw Nas. I saw Nas at fucking. I saw Nas perform at fucking Icons. I think I was there for that. Were you there for that? Yeah. I was. I was standing here. Yeah, Nas I was, was standing. I th- yeah, I think I remember right he, there, bro. Yeah, over by the little bar thing, right? He was standing on those little the steps, the little steps. I think little, I was there that night. I was there that night too. We were probably. I mean, we I was probably standing right next to the stage. Knew each other at that point. Well, yeah. That was like, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, we don't know each other. We didn't know each other like, like that, yeah, like yeah, now. Yeah. Like, I knew hey, it's Jared, door door guy. What's up? Nah, I was a door guy back. What was our door guy back? Because it's two two thousand ten. What the fuck are you doing? Nothing. Just keep 2010 going. He's doing that was shit, doing that shit my family loves. Look at him. <laughs> yeah. I got back here oh five. Maybe I was working door. I think it was right before because that's when I. I remember he nine ten. It had to be nine yeah, ten. Probably nine because I remember I got pictures. Sneaker fiend was doing yeah, the shows yeah. and I had my shirts there, Lethal Legend shirts, which that, I might bring back. That was. That's, you talking about the Sh- Shoesopia. Yeah. This was before Shoesopia. That's what I'm saying. I I think he, he was doing promotion at that time. It had to be had to be 2010 because that's... that's. And I think he said Nas was going to be there. 910. And he was just hanging out. Yeah. Yeah, I think I remember that shit. In 2009, 2010, I definitely was chilling with, with Sneaker Fiend and I was still... Are you okay? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't remember what the fuck? <laughs> I was just thinking about... Something. I'm mad this shit. You, you were looking me in the eye and you were like, are you okay? <laughs> Like what the fuck? I was just thinking about <laughs> Because I saw what he's doing. I I just was just I'm just laughing at myself. But it threw me off. Like, he's like <laughs> <laughs> Topping off the microphone. No, no, no. Chill out, chill out. Topping no, no, off no, the no. microphone. Fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. He's like turns. <laughs> like a blind man wearing these kinds of things. <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, oh, put those yeah. on. Put those on. Put those on. But these on? Yeah, be careful with those. Oh, okay. They they they're knockoffs. That noise. That was me. I tapped my. Uh, I was like, "Yep." Here now, just try them on. Don't, don't put them on all show. Oh, okay. Be careful. As he puts his fingerprints on the lenses. Hey, no, 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 no. Got the frames. No, no sunglass etiquette. They tight. So are these? Let me see. I feel like Elton John wearing these <laughs> from a far, far place <laughs> away. Can I see you? What? 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 <laughs> you look like somebody's granny. Maybe I do. All I need is uh, the thing over my head. <laughs> as we do, yeah. See, there you go. As we do selfies on uh, to show our narcissism on social media. I'm definitely narcissistic. Feel like, Everybody yeah. is these days. Like, it's it's kind of it's kind of like part of the plan, well, not part of the plan, part of living. No. What? That's fine. Oh, okay, that's fine. All right, that's fine. I'm going to. No, nah, you look like no. Nah, you look like you. You need a gold chain right now. And you're like, Here, put uh, this on. You look, so, like, <laughs> you, you look like a fucking. I actually want to give, give you one of my chains. I've, I've like been thinking a, about it too. I want to get a gold we'll get rope. A like I want like a fat joint. Yeah, but they're like twelve hundred dollars. It's more than twelve hundred dollars. No, well, no, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, gold's not cheap right now. No, back it's, saying, like, it's the weight. It's the weight. Oh, I want. Yeah, that I just want a fat. It's gold based on rope. weight, so you'll probably you'll probably pay like twenty five. That's a waste of money. Twenty five hundred. That's it's a not a waste. It's gold. It's not a waste of money. True. Cause not it's, it's actually not a waste of when money. When the shit hits the fan, I can use it for fucking yeah. collateral. Because literally, <laughs> you're literally, it's, it's basically Take exchanging currency. Huh? It's basically exchanging currency. Yeah, you're right. You're it's right. exchanging a fake currency for a real, a real currency. currency. For a tangible. Right. Tangible right. in currency. Right. It's not going to, it might lose but a little millionaires, bit. But millionaires say that buying jewelry is a waste of money, though. Buy yeah, diamonds. because they, they can buy anything oh, they buying want. buying diamonds and shit. Well, yeah. like the little cheap-ass diamonds. It, it, diamonds, period. Like why? Why, why, why is that? Di- yeah, because there's no diamond standard. 
this is a gold standard. Uh, oh, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, it's silly. They're just, just diamonds. They're just fucking I mean, old ass rocks. But I mean, you can also make fake diamonds. Fake ones now. Yeah, you make fake gold, and it, you could tell it's fake gold. Mm-hmm. Real pure gold. You fucking. Hmm. So there's no real way to. That's why I got well, these. Well, I'm sure they can make it. That's why I got chemists, these. Chemists can make it. Chains on. So, it, so hold Come on. Ahead. So there's no standard for diamond, right? But you can tell a real one from a fake one if you had an expert. Yeah. Why? A, a so what, but doesn't that create a standard though? No, no. The, 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 no, they're the so United good at it now. They can they can make like real well, diamonds look like real diamonds. But I'm saying that well, when I say the standard, I'm saying the U.S. dollar used to be backed by the gold standard. Yes. Okay. So for every U.S. dollar printed, there was gold to back it. Yeah, there was physical gold to back it, and then. The what the Fed the Fed Federal Reserve Federal Reserve just started printing money and it's just fake money out there for real for real. It's yeah. just numbers now. It's not even. It don't mean shit. Yeah, it's just digital numbers. Like that's why I like this this goddamn my other uncle. My this, other uncle. This was deficit. <laughs> like to me, it's some bullshit. But okay, what? Well, I mean, I don't. I don't care anymore. Yeah, I don't either. We just want to live in peace. I mean, that's all I got. That's all I want to do. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I just want to live. I had to, live. An- I had to answer all the fucking. Why do you have kids? Ah, oh. because I'm like, I, cause, because I live here. Yeah, with her. Mm. Yeah, I get asked that sometimes too. Like, why aren't you married yet? Why yeah, like, because I don't fucking. I'm, I'm, I don't know you, bitch. I'm I'm like, like, I like. Oh my god, like, that's why. I no, like, no, no, no. That's, that's, <laughs> I like buying things for myself. I like quiet time. I I kind of gotta go with you on that one. You know what I'm um, saying I like my peace of mind without like I like my single peace of mind. I love my single peace of mind. Speaking, it's not emotion, but just mental health. Yeah, it's my last yeah. relationship was fucking abusive. Like yeah. I, I it, it it like clicked right after like I ended it or the, or the last fight. Mm-hmm. Like I hung the like I hung the phone up. Like. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like you I think not, you think abuse like is like physical hitting. You know what I'm saying? There you go. Damn it, that's fine. <laughs> I was doing so good too. <laughs> you, know like, you, weren't. you need like a little. This is the mark where you do it. You need so, you need something to be. <laughs> yeah, like, a, a fucking rag around that. Now you just need like a ding, like in the bottom corner. Um. Oh well, yeah, the counter for every time he does it, he, we yeah. have to take a shot. No, we don't have to. Do um, that. But but yeah, um, yeah. I like it. It took like all that arguing and all that just making me feel bad. Cause you know what I like, think. Why are you is? making me? Why you make me feel bad? Like you remember, make me feel bad. I remember you told me that you, when when I was going through my shit. I yeah. Remember you told me that. Like just tell her that. Yeah. Like you like is that like you make me feel bad. Mm. That's it. You make me feel bad. At one point you made me happy. And you know what I'm saying. And then the now you don't. Bullshit came in. Yep. But why? I didn't do anything different. I was just being me. Now you won't. No, that's what it is. Like it's not even being. They, it's not even that. It's just like well, they expect you to be a certain way. Nah, they man. want you to change. Like they. At, no, maybe it may be an age thing, but they. A lot of them try to change people. I wouldn't say that. It's just. Um, it, but that's how I feel. I mean, in my situation, sometimes. But it's 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 like. You you make me feel bad. Nobody has the right to make you feel bad. I agree. Yeah, fuck those people. Oh my god. Yeah, go ahead. I'm listening. I'm just I'm just, I'm just reiterating <laughs> but, but the statement, like, baby. Like, sure, do you make me feel bad? Mm. Like, you literally make me feel bad. I don't. I'm not happy. It's more of a brain thing for me. I'm not happy, and I feel like you manipulate that. Mm. Even if you don't manipulate it, even if you aren't trying. You still He's do. still doing it, even if you it's still unconscious. still making me feel bad. Even so why am, I, why am I trying to make this work? <clears throat> yeah, well, that's what I, that's what I was gonna say. Um, I think now that's we, why I'm saying we I try to we I'm try not, to be, with society the way it is. We we kind of we try to make it work because we're, we're supposed to try to make it work. Well, you try to, you try to make it work because you have time invested in it. I don't know if time and really at some has point and at some point it. you were happy. And that's why I think that you're trying to make it work. Like, like this is supposed to work, or not supposed to, but but at some, at some point it just stops working. Yeah, and it's like, that, but 
Man, this is a tricky one. Like, why are you starting to fight like now about nothing? Oh, don't go. I don't. I'm definitely just saying, don't but I'm saying, there. like, why are you starting to fight now about nothing? Like, yeah, we was chilling. <laughs> we was just chilling. I'm at peace. I, I'm at peace right now. You're disturbing my peace. I was reading this email from work. just because you didn't like something. Yeah, or or, I, or the way I handled something. Yeah. Uh, yes. And like you didn't like how I handled something that didn't have nothing to do but, with you. And and I, exactly. But I'm supposed to fucking read your mind and read your feelings at the same time. My feelings don't get taken taken. Get this account. fight. Get this fight. One of the last ones, right? Mm. This, yeah, this was one of the last ones. I'm telling her about a coworker. Oh, who was I, it a female coworker? No, it was a dude. Oh shit. Who I'm like, man, I just don't fuck with cuz mm-hmm. like that. But then I, this is what I this is what I said, and this is what made her whatever the fuck. I said, if I didn't work with them and have to depend on, you know, my job, depending on his him doing his job, mm-hmm. I I think he would be like a pretty decent dude. Mm-hmm. I think we could we could be friends mm-hmm. if I wasn't if I didn't have to if I didn't have to be with this motherfucker. Mm-hmm. If I didn't have to work with this person, I think he would be cool because I wouldn't I wouldn't. Yeah, there's a I wouldn't put up with like his his idiosyncrasies and his laziness and all this shit. Mm-hmm. It wouldn't affect me cuz I don't work with it. It's not affecting my workload, it's not affecting my time. He's he's a cool enough person, but just the working, I don't like him cuz of work. Mm-hmm. It's just like why, why why would you say that? I'm mad that you said that. Like why are you mad that I said that? Does it not make sense to you what I just no, said? You know what it is? It was you were expe- expressing your feelings. That's all it was. But you're I'm, not expe- like I said. We're only expected. We're only expected to have two feelings: well, anger and happiness. Well, I mean, shit. I can't feel. I can't feel feelings for you. And I can't. Your what you feel like you. I should feel. I can't feel that. exactly. It doesn't work like that. I'm not a. I'm not a spiteful person. Yeah. I'm not a petty person. I'm a very honest person, I, I, and I know how to fucking put people in categories like. Do, that's that's a weird one right there. What that was like? How she reacted to that? Yeah, I'm like, and I'm just sitting like, like, why is this happening? Maybe maybe uh, maybe she took it as you were talking about her, like, because women's brains don't what? No, I'm just I'm, yeah, li- no, I'm listening. listening. Yeah, women's yeah, brains, I'm, I'm listening, man. Work they internalize the shit. Yeah, yeah, and 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 she, whatever you're saying, it, it probably has something to do with what you did. Not intentionally, like three weeks ago, you know what I'm saying. But she didn't say nothing. Yeah, I don't know. But a lot of that, yeah, a lot of that shit is just fucking internalizing shit for too long, not fucking expressing your shit, and then it just boom that that it just explodes. I don't want to talk about it. All right. No, no, I'm saying. <laughs> no, I'm saying. No, no, I get you. That, that's what I'm saying. I don't want to talk about it. And, and look, it, I don't want to talk about it. And and then this will. You know what? This is my this is my reaction when it when it when, okay nah man <laughs> like, man look because I'm not gonna fucking I'm not gonna do that if I'm you want ha- child shit look man if you want to have a successful relationship with somebody you have to talk about it mm-hmm. you got to talk about it and you can't I get it. and you can't take it fucking pers- you can't take criticism personally but well, if you do take it personally fuck you then leave break up but I know plenty of people tried that many times. I know plenty of people in my family. Mm-hmm. Who've been married for a very long time? Mm-hmm. They've been through rocky times, but they can they communicate, they talk it out, and they figure the fuck that's figure like, it the fuck out. That's all you have to do. If I'm if I have to fucking alter my shit for you, then there's a problem. I'm not gonna do that anymore. Like why why am I fucking like what why I gotta fucking walk on eggshells around you? Fuck you. Mm. You make me feel bad. <laughs> <laughs> that's your joint right there. But I was like, yo, you like I hung the phone up. I was like, yo, that's abuse right there. That's abusive. Mm-hmm. I was stone sober, wasn't drinking no alcohol, wasn't smoking weed, wasn't nothing. I was stone sober. Like, what the fuck? That made me feel bad. Mm-hmm. I was in touch with my emotions and my feelings. And I love her to death. I still do. Hope for the best for her. But she but she she has her own issues. Yeah, no, like, and like, I and I don't have to be there to figure them out. Nah, just, no, they they have to figure that shit out. I mean, they, just like or, you or they don't figure your shit out, or they don't. Uh, they, I mean, sometimes they don't because because sometimes because because women will never have a problem finding a dude willing to put up with that shit. Uh, 
for for a, a whatever amount of time it takes them to grow out of it. That's a weak motherfucker that does that, though. It, it, or maybe a strong motherfucker that does that. Either way, it's not my concern. I ain't doing all that shit. Have at it. <laughs> Godspeed. Mm-hmm. Good night and good luck. You know what I'm saying? Speaking of emotions, like I definitely, I'm 100% in touch with my emotions all the time. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah, you got to be. And and showing emotion, like you can't show everybody emotion. You really can't. Some people take emotions different ways. Yeah, they do. Well, a lot of people are simple-minded. Like to, to be emotionally fucking uh, intelligent, intelligent and cognizant and aware of yourself, you have to realize that there are a million people out there who are not. True. Yeah, there's a lot of stupid people in the world. No, 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 no. I mean, you gotta That's be stupid. It's, it's, not, just, it's just you gotta have a self actualization. Cogn- cognitive intelligence and emotional intelligence are two different things. Yeah, this is science, psychology. Yeah, you can be you can be intelligent. You know what I'm saying? And you can be emotionally dumb. You know, yeah, mm, but you also you at the emo- same time or, or emotionally. Um, at, fuck, at the same the time, you can have empathy. But you can't read other other people's minds. You know what I'm saying? That's that's one big thing that um I think is overlooked. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, you don't have empathy. Uh, or maybe you should have just said what you wanted to say instead of fucking holding. So I can't it read in. your fucking mind. Yeah, I'm not gonna, and I'm not gonna try. Like that, that's an impossible task to fucking overtake. But anyway, RJ, you got any thoughts on this, sir? Or are you just learning life lessons right now? Well, I mean, they're life lessons, and I just want to, you both to know that I love you very much. We love you too, bro. All right. And uh, I think, uh, you know, we as people, uh, you know, we get older and we develop. What our do you people. mean, we as people? We as people. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, you people? <laughs> what do you mean, you people? Oh, my God. I feel uh, like I can, I can handle, like, two bitches. I ain't got time for it. I don't either, but I feel like <laughs> yeah. no, I feel like I could be like straight up like uh, 100% like honest. She only want me for If it, uh, yeah, if you're straight up if you're straight up honest and they're both down with it, I think I could do I, that too. I, think I could finesse that. I think I could finesse that. I don't know about you. I didn't say I could, and I'm I don't not, know, I don't and I'm not saying brain. I'm even going to try. I th- I think I can finesse that. Um I just know it's can, difficult handling myself sometimes, so I'd let alone Two other people. I don't think I got. I can. I can. I can. I think my gift of gab is good enough when it's on. Hey, baby. If I'm feeling, if I'm feeling confident, go ahead and lick her pussy too. No, 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 no. I'm not talking about like that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Look at RJ's face. Like, no, nah, I'm not. I'm not talking about. Hey, like so you got that. some I know more I'm of just that? With you got you. some more of that beer you got Jesus down there? Christ. What? You got some more. What you you fucking there's a beer at? right there. I know, but I want to try your beer. <laughs> Yeah, but I want to drink your beer. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, am I getting bullied on? on no, on, you're not. I'm you just asking you to try your beer. Oh, fuck, man. Every week with this shit. Yeah, because you bring over the shit that looks like a fucking, you know, Picasso fucking design the can hey, or bottle. I have good taste in art. I, that's great. And you have old American <laughs> shit. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> says a lot. What is sir. it? Was it the champagne of beers? No, no that's, that's uh, Miller Lite. No. Ooh. That's um, It is Miller Lite. It's not Miller Lite. It's, it's Miller High Life. It's Miller High Life. Life. Okay. Miller. High Life. There, trust me, the yes, marketing is, is different. Oh, my God, I know. It's the champagne. You know. So what is this? You know, six, was it Miller that was the first? 16 point. You know what light beer is? Like, the the, the, the original reason things, I forgot what company water. it was. Hmm? It was water. No. When, I learned this in a marketing class Here, let me, uh, man, what years is, ago. What fucking the original... Um, beer that came out. I can't remember what company. It was one of the top American beers, but they came out. Thing. They came out with it, and whatever it was, it, it said diet on the can. Ooh. So it was. I, I want to say wants to drink diet beer. I want to say Miller was the first one. So Miller, what, mean, whoever it was, I don't remember who it was. It was either Miller or Budweiser. But anyway, uh, they came out, and it was blah 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 beer. Light, and then they the shit didn't sell because they were trying to sell. Of course, beer is mostly for men, so and they were trying to cater. They were to trying a to sell, but the shit wasn't teenage white chicks. 
No, no, they were trying to sell. They were trying to sell to men who wanted to stay in shape and whatever. Michelob. So Zero. because, but so they didn't sell anything because it was called diet because men didn't want diet beer, so they changed it to light. So when you're drinking light, it's just diet, diet beer. beer. Well, I mean that's the way I, I would look at it anyway. I, yeah, but you don't look at it that way. I do. Do you consciously thought think of it that way? No, but if I had to think about it, like, if you had to think about it, yes. I, if I had to think about if it, if I if I never brought that up to you, would you have known? I mean, if you sit there and think about, it, like, if I was sitting in a bar and I had, I was just randomly thinking about what you just spoke about. I feel like I'm intelligent enough to come up to, maybe not the diet factor, but that the light beer is a kind of, I don't want to use the word pussified. Uh, I'm not, no, 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 no. But I'm saying like it's just a light, it's a lighter beer, so therefore. It's pussified. What? As you drink my fucking man beer. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with the beer I drink. Bitch. Okay. Nothing wrong with the beer I drink. <laughs> uh, it's a little light. No. It's a little light. And it's, uh, C- compared to this is, this is a different... 50, more than 50% owned by a Brazilian company. Uh, oh my <coughs> God. Uh, sorry. Sorry. That's okay. It's not American anymore, folks. That's what I'm trying yeah, to say. Yeah, that's, I know that's what you're saying. Back. So, all right. So, what else do we have in our little handful of notes? Oh, no, RJ, come up with something. Oh, uh, I know what you're talking about. Pew, pew. Oh, we haven't said that in a few weeks. Uh, the Washington Nationals are still, as of February 5th, 2020, your World Series champions. Shit, and as of, as of the recording of this, fucking Alex Ovechkin is two goals away from yes. 700. I'm so 700. 700. Yeah. Man. He uh he had he, 40, had, a he had a chat trick the other night and four last night yeah last night and then four forty goals for the season were you there last night yeah so oh it's crazy so they were losing two to one yeah there was five minutes left in yeah. the in the third right and I really wasn't watching it yeah I wasn't I saw either. they I saw them tie it and then they won four to two yeah and, and I was o- like what and Ovi ended with a hat trick yeah he scored all three of those goals <laughs> that shit was crazy. Insane. So insane. And they were showing a stat breakdown of like their goals per period, and the Cavs have like twenty plus, dude. Like something. It did. It did in the third. Did, yes, in the third. That's man. not good. Nah. No, um, no, yeah, because they get good. behind no. early. Well, yeah, against the good. good teams in the playoffs. That's yeah, not that's good. not good at all. You need to be able to fucking score you throughout score, the game. Yeah, right. that's true. Because they will stop. Shots you. on goal, baby. They will stop that shit. Yeah, they can't expect you. <laughs> You know what? I, I don't think I would have ever got into hockey if they had never started getting into playoffs. Like this is like ten years ago. Well, that I since I've been watching. Uh, no, I've been watching oh, even man. younger than that because I used to have a Capitals joint. Capitals. Uh, it was a shirt, wasn't a jersey. I forgot the player. I want to say Hathaway. Who? Hathaway. Mm-hmm. Way back in the nineties. You don't have to know who it is. I mean, I, I just I literally don't know who that is. Is there a clean beaker? I mean, uh, a shot? Yeah. Hathaway. No, nah, I never is heard of it. Those are clean. Oh, those to, are dirty. I went to my first game in 96. Just take one out of there. Thanks. Yeah. I went to my first Caps game in 96. They played the fucking Bruins. The Bruins. And the I, Bruins. And I've been a fucking diehard fan ever since. Ever since. Ever since. That shit was the best. That was uh, the best sport, sports experience I've ever been to. I remember when I went to my first wrestling match, man. Oh, that shit was awesome. Yeah. I was fucking marking out, dude. I was fucking Bondra. I was a huge Peter Bondra fan. Huge. Huge. Peter Bondra, Sergey Gonchar. Huge. Kali Johansson. Oh. Um, Olaf Kolzig. So, yeah. Caps won the Stanley Cup this year or what? I mean, I can't call it. I hope so. Shit. They're the best team, the best record in the league. I think they've been winning too much early. I mean, shit. That's But they've always done that. I know. And then they lose in the fucking first round of the playoffs. Well, we'll see. We'll see. I mean, they skipped a year, so. But also, uh, fucking Carolina uh, did that bullshit last year and hurt goddamn T.J. Oshie. Nobody got suspended for that shit. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, that they, is very true. Wait, no, yeah. Tom Wilson was the year that they won, right? Tom Wilson, what? Where he was suspended for a few games in the first yeah. round. No, he was suspended for a few games. For the yeah. season, right? No, it was yeah, it was it was. Uh, he came back against the Penguins, I think. Last year or the that's what I'm saying. Which year? Championship year. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I mean, shit, they didn't get past Carolina last year. He couldn't. 
Well, that, Shit, that's Backstrom, where Backstrom uh, came back. That's where the old the old manager went. Old coach Trotz. Yeah, he he went to New York. Yeah, he's an Islanders coach now. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. With New York. But no, that's where he came from, right? Carolina. Was it Carolina? No, Tennessee. Where? where it, no, Barry Trotz was in Arizona, I believe. Are you sure? I'm about to check. Trotzy. Look it up. Barry Trotz. <clears throat> you can keep talking. There, yeah. Audrey. Well, no, this beer is not Tennessee. Nashville. Nashville. Yeah, that's Tennessee. Damn, 97 to 2014. That is a long yeah, he's he was uh he was well known down well, shit, there. Shit, ninety seven was when they came into the league. Oh, he was there from ninety seven till then. Ninety seven to two thousand fourteen. Shit, he, so he built that franchise then. Yeah, for the most part. I mean, there's still some shit. Ninety six. Hmm. Come on, that's yeah, ninety eight to present. Damn, he was there before they were <laughs> from ninety seven, and they fucking the team started in ninety eight. That's he's, wild. He's some shit. Or not he. I'm, I mean, them. Bro, them they Trotsy? No, I'd say, I meant they. Oh, I'm about to say, man, Trotsy. I love Trotsy. Oh, no, stop attacking me, Greg. Trotsy. Uh, okay. <laughs> Trotsy did that fucking hot lap. I was like, yes. Oh, that's why they won. Oh, yeah, because the team was just like having fun at that point. Mm-hmm. They're like, dude, fuck it. We know we're better than these motherfuckers. And that's what he, that's why he They've did They've always it. been better than the other team. That's the crazy thing about it. Yeah. They, They've always been better. It's just, but they just, the late, they didn't know how to do the it. The mental shit is what it is. Yeah, they didn't know how to do it. And then they just figured it out. Like, oh, this is it? Yo, they fuck. Just fucking body these motherfuckers. Just body them. That second, that, uh, not the second, uh, the finals, in that last game. We beat the fuck out of them. They, <laughs> I was at National Harbor watching that they shit. Even, I was like, yo, this shit's over. Dude, they that that whole series, was it 4-1? Yeah. Yeah. They, yeah, that yeah. wasn't even like a that wasn't even a contest. They, they won the first game, dude. Uh, the the game won. Yeah. The Knights won the first game. No, 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 no. No, they didn't. They won the second game. No, they won the, the We're no, talking no, about they, the finals. Yeah. Stanley yeah. Cup finals. Yeah, they they yeah, the Knights oh, won wait, the first wait, game. Wait. No, you know, I'm sorry. I'm thinking about Wait, what the fuck am I thinking about? Are you thinking about the Nats? No, the blue team. The, the, the Tampa, Tampa Bay, Bay. Lightning, yeah. yeah. The Tampa Bay Lightning. That oh, was, you're, are what, you talking about the Stanley? They Cup swept finals? one of them teams. The Tampa no, Bay. No, they swept they Tampa Bay. They, no, they swept. Well, okay, no, they swept two teams. Well, they either swept two teams or went to Game Five. Oh, well, they, remember they, they won like what the? Oh, I thought you were looking up. You were on am. Twitter? No, no, I'm they not. won every no. game on the road though. Yeah. They they won every series on the road. I think they won. I think they won. Didn't they? They won like five straight or some shit. Was, yeah. <coughs> I'm saying like the, the Stanley crazy. Cup finals. I think they won. One. They won six or well, five six versus. Let me look this. up. I don't remember. I but I know you. I, you're. I know you're right. I just don't remember which series is that, that it was. No, I th- it was from the end of the. They swept somebody. Okay, we're seven. Didn't games. they sweep the lightning? No, they no 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 no, no, no way, dude. No, I'm sorry. No, that was, they went to seven games. So wait, okay. What well, went to seven games? They did go to seven games. Yeah, with the, uh, Tampa, Tampa Bay. Bay. Oh, so then it was five. It was four to one four to against the nope. no no uh, against the Knights. No, dude, yes. they lost the they lost the very yeah. So they lost the very first game against the Knights and then won the other four. I don't okay, think so yeah, no, I, I, yes. no, he's right. I remember watching it. I swear to God, it was the first game. I was like, all so right. So where did I watch the Lightning? The, oh, that was that to was go a, to was, the finals. Yeah, I was watching that. Yeah, yeah. That's, that was I was I was at National Harbor. For yeah, that yeah. That was the conference final. Okay. I was the luckiest for all that shit. Getting fucking ripped. Yeah, I remember when Ovi picked the cup up, dude. Never Holy started shit. I was at the house with that one. Oh, dude. The fucking dude, the bar was going so crazy, fucking, dude. That's so fucking like I don't know where I was at for that shit. For the Knights game. No, I was at the house because my dad was in the hospital. Dude, mm-hmm. dude, that was by he, far. He passed away the day after the fucking parade. That's right, dude. Uh, didn't, mean to, didn't mean to be somber. No, no. That's just sorry. how I did remember he, that. They, uh, was he in the hockey? Uh, Not really. But I he mean, was he was in, in the D.C. sports. Yeah, okay. So he, at least he got to see He that. didn't see it. He, I don't think he ah. saw it. I don't think he saw it. Like, he was out. Of, he was in the hospital, like, mm. for game, uh, what, five and four and five? Uh, uh, I think he went to the Tampa Bay joint. Don't know the finals. 
Okay, four Stanley Cup Damn, yeah. man, we've been in the playoffs so much lately. Yeah. I don't, I don't remember who was where. Yeah, I, I remember like sitting. I was in the house watching that game. Like, mm. like I, dude, I don't crazy. remember when they won. Where the fuck was I when they won? I don't know. I think you were at a viewing party or yeah, something. You, you said you were watching harbor. it outside. You you at the harbor, weren't you? No, no. For Tampa Bay, I was at the harbor. Well, no, I saw you like maybe twenty Lockies. minutes after. It was on a. F- nah, nah. It was on a Thursday because Friday was, yeah. was when I had that Cavs fifty and I got killed, bro. Yeah, you like, probably luckies. Luckies, dude. I was standing was like luckies? I still have the the two beer bottles I was holding. They're upstairs. Well, like, so, damn, I really don't. Yeah, know. So, all, I don't literally <laughs> have them. Well, it's all good. We just gonna get another one. There's a gap between. Fucking in his memories, yeah. There's a, no, there's a gap, a lot of gaps. That I think I fucking psychologically blocked. It was a long time. But ago that so. from from that time period. It was a long time ago. <laughs> Wasn't that long? Did a lot of drinking. Yeah. It was a great summer. RJ, not well. That wasn't was a great summer. I know, Last summer was a great summer. Yeah, it was a rough summer. Last summer was good. Yeah, last summer was good. That, that summer was that summer started out all right. That, 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 that summer was surreal. It's like fuck. Well, what what is, so what's the time looking like, buddies? One hundred three plus sixteen. You know what? I mm-hmm. think that might be Greg, right. Greg likes to do that. I do, yeah. but I think I know it, we don't got nothing to talk about. So yeah, I think a nice little tight. What sixty-seven minutes was mm-hmm. good. RJ kicked that shit. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to kick that shit for you. Thank you for listening to episode thirty-one of the Mad Scientist Lab podcast. As always, it is I, RJ the Pizza Guy, along with Jared the Visual Mad Scientist, and Greg the Movie Guy. That's me. So when we, <clears throat> excuse me, before I pass out here. That was way worse. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> so when you join us next week, hopefully we will have a big surprise for everybody. Uh, and I'm not trying to anticipate or build any anticipation around that. However, that's what I'm doing currently. Ergo. And there we go. The architect in uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Everybody seen the Matrix, right? No? Okay. Yeah. Carry on. Speaking of the architect, I was watching Inception earlier. Oh, yes, carry I, on. I, I just love that movie so much. Yes. It's just got movie. so many just dope ass oh. scenes and before we go, Black History Month, baby. But, oh yes, and all of us here. Bob are... Molly, one love. Go ahead. No, oh, yeah. Sorry. Uh, what I was gonna say is, is I love that movie, and uh, I love lots of things. Several things I can't think of. Okay, so yeah, great. You got to get the. Yep. Oh, I'm not doing that. Nah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't get no views when we did that last time. Do something. Uh, yeah, you're, right, you're right. Shit, we they're trying to music. take us down, man. All right. <laughs> uh, righty, folks. No, uh, thank you for listening, and that was we'll alcohol see you next that. week. Ah, oh, fucking herb. Shimmy, shimmy, y'all, shimmy, yummy, shit. I feel like, dude. What? I, I, well, I'll talk to you after we stop recording. Okay. Uh. Goodbye, everybody. Yeah. Maybe. Bye bye. Oh, hold on. I gotta, I gotta get find my mouse first. Bear. We gonna beat you so hard you ain't gonna see nothing. Bye. I'm gonna hit you so ever, hard you won't ever. see nothing. Ever, 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 ever. <laughs>